Also in Power City, there's a big vote on the cards tomorrow for the United Steelworkers Union. They'll be voting on the latest contract ratification from ExxonMobil. And union officials say they will not be pushing for members to vote no this time around. Union rep Brian Gross says they are leaving it up to the members. Gross says the members fall into two different camps. One who wants to call an end to the lockout after 10 long months. And another who says they've already waited 10 months. Why not stick it out? It's, it's 10 months and, uh, you know, they're ready to go back to work. So we're going we're gonna to let a vote decide which way we go. Last week, Exxon provided the union a modified offer that included the addition of the Martin Luther King holiday to the calendar, updated language to the union workmen's committee, and separate job classifications for different jobs. We will, of course, find out tomorrow what the union members decide.